Hey, welcome to Spanos Antics. Today, we are doing a bit of barn finding. So, we got a heads up about this place. A little while ago, uh, somebody came in saying they'd seen some old van, they got some old uh, camper vans in a barn, and said, well, I'd like to look at them. Uh, I then came to have a look, we made a deal. And so this stuff's been sat here for 20 years. He's been paying a thousand pounds storage every year for 20 years. Uh, and she's been sat here, all parked up in 2001, 2002. So let's have a look, see what's here. Here we go. So this is the first one. Now this is the one that did have a Type 25 parked right there. You'll see the pictures. I took that one out before I started filming videos. So she's a T25 Caravelle, right hand drive with the full seats in the back, chrome bumpers, tinted windows, flip out quarters, tax went out 03. We pulled her out, John, transporter, came and helped me move it. We pulled it out, I took it back to the workshop and uh, give it a little jet wash and a good old soapy clean down. And uh, that's pretty much all I've done to it at the moment. It's just ready looking for a new home. And there's all the caravel seats, super comfy, armrests, auto as well. So. In the first one, we have two boats. First one up, we've got a little Fletcher speedboat. Not sure how big. It's got another boat inside it. Oh, and a cool little steering wheel on a seat. Next to it is a little Avon rib and a couple of bikes. Not too much in this one. Right. To the next one. What we have here is a Tolbert Express. Now, this has been sat here for 20 years, gathering dust and dirt. that in a minute. Little Avon rib. There's a cool little trike. Looks old. Cycle Academy. The best thing about this thing is its name. She's called the Growler. Let's have a look inside the growler. Right, what's in number two? Number three, sorry. What we have here is a nice little T25. That's the reason I really got these. I came here to just try and buy the two vans, but the gent wanted to move the lot, so I've got him in charge of moving everything. Surprisingly, rust free this Type 25. If anyone's interested in it, let me know. It needs rescuing. Very green, just like the yellow one. But that doesn't take long to fix. And next to it is Beaver Patrol. Papa! <laughs> I'm hoping there's a boat guy going to take on all the boat stuff. And next to that, a Nissan Sunny 1989 Nissan Sunny Diesel XL Papa. She has been sat a little while. Interesting. We get that out. 
Yeah, this T25 surprisingly good condition. Considering. Definitely needs a rescue. In the back, absolutely rammed full of crapido. Jesus. Ooh. So there you go. Right, next up is a Mark 1 Renault Traffic. There she is, sat here 20 years, in storage. Now this has actually been bought, and Gent's coming to pick it up soon. He's into his Mark 1 Traffic, and he's going to be restoring it, and doing a YouTube video on it, so watch this space. In front of the Renault. We have this little cool Fletcher. A funky red gel. Look at that old school dash. Isn't she cool? Now be coming up. Little rib next to that. And a whole load of junk. See if the Renault's unlocked. Whoa, she is jammo. Absolutely jammo with stuff. Wowza. All kinds of crappy dope. Oh, Gandhi's in there. Boom. Surprisingly rust free, although it's disgustingly dirty. The guy who bought it has asked me not to touch anything on it, so keep it all dirty. And there it is. That was the last one. So that's it, really. That is all this stuff we found. Hopefully, we can rescue the rest of these vans and give them to good homes. Hope you enjoyed that little barn find. See you later.